For me, I think there's a couple of things. When I think about the, the greatest attribute of, Por of Portland Rotary, uh, one is the remarkable uh, friendliness with which they greet new people coming in and the, and the way that they um, accept new people coming into the group. I think the other thing that I've noticed is there's a tremendous amount of um, resilience and enthusiasm within the group. As things lag in certain areas, others sort of step up and uh, pick up the, the mantle and carry on with new projects. It's a very dynamic organization. It's a little intimidating to walk into a room of 50 people and not know anybody, but everyone has been so welcoming and wonderful, and there are a couple of members in particular just that just stand out and welcome you with open arms and are so joyful, and I always look forward to seeing them. Well, it's kind of habit forming, yes. and it provides a social outlet, and it's also provided a great many opportunities to serve others. I've always felt it's people's, uh, it gives people an opportunity to uh, participate in things that they have a real passion for with regards to helping other people. It's sense of community um, of giving. It's a giving club. It's not just fun to get together. It is doing projects, whether here, statewide, nationwide. I am so appreciative and stimulated every week to go to this meeting and to be around so many grateful and happy, selfless people. What's great about Portland Rotary is there's, it's a small enough club so you get to know and really, really get to know people, but it's a big enough club so you can really do big things. Everything we do is always going toward a, a good cause, so there's always a, a, a great feeling and uh, you find yourself putting in a lot of hours and loving it. My fondest memory is, is, is just a variety of service projects we've done with like-minded people, whether if it's locally or in a, in a different state or different country, just um, it's hard to pick one. I like the camaraderie of having the fellowship with the different members and being involved in doing community projects. That was a big thing for me to be having a, like a hands-on project that we used to do. And that's how we got to know each other. You know, one of the big things we did was the Winterfest. I, that was a treat for me, you know, a uh, winter, winter light, uh, Christmas light show on Eastern Prom. 90% of the members participated some way, somehow in that event. It was a fantastic event. People would get together, whether it was putting up the lights before the event, we were open for 32 nights uh, from just before Thanksgiving uh, till New Year's Eve. When we get behind something, with Chi being the latest example of childhood hunger and education, everyone kind of gets on board. And for a group that size, that's pretty impressive. You join Rotary because you want a vehicle to give back, and that can mean anything. It can mean writing a check. It can mean uh, participating in a service project. It can mean joining some fundraising activity. Uh, so you join for those service sort of aspects, but you develop friendships. I walked into the room, and it was overwhelming. There were all these wonderfully fascinating people and lots of folks to talk with. And I really enjoyed that excitement. I thought it was great fun. The wonderful friends and the laughs and everything, it's kind of the glue that holds Rotary together. And you have to be in the club at least two or three years before you realize the importance of the fellowship. And it's a real privilege to be a part of that. I think the greatest attribute is the members because the members are what make the club and it makes the club great and it's lasted for 100 years which is, shows their greatness. You know, we, we say in the Boys and Girls Club world and the nonprofit world, obviously, you know, time, talent, treasure, and Rotary Club and Rotary members have given so much, both individually and collectively, to the Boys and Girls Clubs. You know, I have a soft spot for, for kids, and so Connect with Boys and Girls Club, I, th I think our, our lasting commitment to work with the Boys and Girls Club of Southern Maine has been fantastic. Um, everything from volunteering just for a simple one-night um, event to helping to run their biggest um, nonprofit fundraising event. Um, pretty meaningful to me. I work at Maine Medical Center and I came to a meeting uh, to do a presentation and afterwards uh, I knew Jim from my connection at Maine Medical Center and he said you have to join Rotary it's a great group uh, just just come be my guest and, and hear more about Rotary and uh, once I heard about um, all the great programs um, I was hooked in particularly the international service um, that's really what drew me into
in, in any given year, we're providing over 100 hearing aids. Uh, so 100 different patients are getting hearing aids. We're providing water filters for uh, Oh, about 500 people roughly uh, benefit. So we provide water filters in each home in these these villages of sugarcane workers. Uh, so there's hundreds of people impacted there. And then prosthetic hands, the number is a bit smaller there, uh, but still very impactful when you can somebody doesn't have a hand and you're able to give them a, a prosthesis so they can uh, they can work again and they can uh, do all these simple tasks that we take for granted. If it would just work. I doubt that I would still be here because I have these other charitable things that I do. But it's the fun part that keeps me in after 33 years. And so it's pretty neat. It's a, a really a, a celebratory time of not only looking back but looking forward to you know the, the best is yet to come for a great service organization like Rotary Club of Portland. Rotary, I find, has always been uh, 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 the kind of thing where no matter how you feel, if you're down in the dumps or if you're feeling happy about something, Rotary is the place to go on Friday because it's always, without exception, uplifting. And I have got so many friends in Rotary now, I don't know what i do without them. Rotary's changed my life in that the friendships I've made, a great deal of my friends that I, I mean, we, we have coffee with some of my Rotarian friends. We have lunch on Wednesday with some of my Rotarian friends. We play tennis with Rotarian friends, so that's a, a pretty big impact. It's really part of Portland. Portland Rotary is really part of Portland, and I just adore Portland. And so I think it's, it's special. It's, it's an institution in this city. It's a very important thing. So I stay for the fun, and I stay for the legacy, and I stay because I want it to be there for other people in the future. You don't know you need Rotary until somebody shares that experience with you. And once you become part of this family, you get so much more back than you ever put into it. Like I say, here I am 25 and a half years later, not realizing 25 and a half years ago that I'd still be here today. And I love every one of the members who, they become like family to me. And you, you can go to any one of them if you have a problem. So to me, it's an extended family, and I wouldn't trade it for the world. Well, uh, I had a lot of fond memories. Uh, one of great people, just outstanding people. I would like to wish Portland Rotary Club an unbelievably happy centennial celebration. Uh, I, I haven't been here for as many years as it might seem, uh, but uh, uh, I've been here long enough to have uh, learned a lot from a lot of those who have uh, gone before and I've made a lot of friendships and uh, uh, it's, uh, Rotary has enriched my life. Happy 100th anniversary Portland Rotary, I'm very proud of you. Happy 100th anniversary Portland Rotary, may it continue on and on. You know what, a hundred, a hundred of anything is, um, is, is impressive, but a hundred years of service to, to one community and to the world is, is really impressive. It's, it's, I'm very proud to be a part of it. So, um, Paul and Rotary, to everyone past, future, and present, happy 100th anniversary. Great job. I'm delighted to offer Rotary happy anniversary for its 100th birthday. Mm -hmm.